Hello, and welcome to Blues Learning Session 2. To understand our lyrics are used in blues songs with me, Mr. Coop. So in Learning Session 2, your learning objective is to understand how lyrics are used in blues songs and your success criteria to be able to write about the structure of the verse of St. Louis Blues. Okay, call and response. We did touch briefly on this in learning session one, but I just want to go in a little bit more detail. So this is when somebody speaks or sings and it's responded by somebody or something else. It's not necessarily a singer. So in the next example we've got, I hate to see the evening sun go down. Again, it repeats, I hate to see the evening sun go down. Now that is said by one person and everybody else says this it makes me think of all my left go round so that is a call and response we've got the call in the first two lines and we have the response in the third line and a, another example in the next verse feeling tomorrow like i feel today feeling tomorrow like i feel today i'll pack my trunk and make my getaway so uh, not the most exciting of words for that song. So that might make you think about a question that I'll come on to later on. But there we go. We have the first two lines, which is a call. And the last line of each verse is a response. In this example, the call and response isn't actually done by two people or more than one person. It's actually done by the same person, Bessie Smith, who sings the song. This is just known as a call and response pattern when it's the same person doing both the call and the response. And I've put there, do you notice anything about how the lyrics are laid out? Okay, so let's have a listen to this song. Good evening. 
So that song is called the St. Louis Blues, which is the song we're going to have a look at today. So think about the song you have just listened to. Is there anything that you could tell me about that song? So pause this video, jot down anything that you think you can tell me about that song. Okay, and moving on, what do you think Bessie Smith is singing about? So have a think about the lyrics that you've just been listening to. We'll, if you want to go back to the, the previous slide when we had a look at the lyrics, that is fine. So what do you think Bessie Smith is singing about? What instruments would you say are playing during this track? Is there any instrument in particular that stands out? There is a little bit of a clue in this track because if you go back to the start of the video, it does actually tell you what instruments are playing and who's playing them. Was there a difference at the end of the song compared to the beginning? Have a think about that as well. Okay, what I want you to do now is to go to your session pack and see if you can answer some of the questions from today's learning session. 